Yo, what up, man? Welcome to Move Math, episode two. We got today. We have two, problem two, episode two. You know what? I love when that happens. We got y prime is equaling e to the negative three x. Say no joke, man. Say no joke. Oh, let's get get dy over dx is equal to e to the negative three x. So then you got to separate it. Dy equals e to the negative three x dx, and then you got to integrate that shit. So you got to integrate dy equal to the integral of negative three x dx. Yeah, man, that's it. And then you got to so you get y plus constant c. Actually, no. We if you want to know how the constants work, go to the previous video. So you get y equals. Uh, negative 1 over 3 e to the negative 3x plus a constant. That's the family of solutions for y right there. Boom. Uh, so what, what more can I say? As an aside right here, as an aside, this is the aside region. And so um, d k e to the dx plus alpha over dx. Alright, this is the most general form you can get. What would you get with that? You're going to get k, because the constant just gets carried through, times d, so the constant gets brought down, that's the power, and then when you have e to the x, you just get the same thing again, so you get times e to the dx plus alpha. That's the general form, okay? So when you're going backwards, you divide by d. So here we went backwards with the backwards, as in the integrals going backwards with respect to the with the differentiation. All right, this is an e by the way. It's kind of a very sha very shallow hole in the e. Now it's made a bit larger, but now it kind of looks like a c with the top crossed top. But that's not important. So when you have negative three here, which would be equal to d in this case, we have alpha equals zero, k equals one. So you see this 1 here is k, alpha is 0, there's no plus here. So then we, you just divide it by this. So divide, 1 divided by negative 3 equals 1 over 3, or negative 1 over 3. Then you get this. So that's the solution. Thank you for watching. Thank you for watching. And uh, math, math gives you fucking huge arms. So keep on lifting and doing math. You'll, you too can be huge one day. You can also be huge one day. This one's not as big, I think. I don't know. It doesn't look as big. Now there we go. I kind of hurt my left elbow, so it's kind of lacking a little bit right now. But uh, the right always pops. And it's pretty good. Anyways, that kind of ruined the atmosphere of math, but uh, let it serve as motivation to you. You gotta, you gotta work out your body to work out your mind. Get it all working together, you know? It's all good shit. It's good shit. Okay, anyways, goodbye.